Hello. Um, I wanted to make a video testimonial of my experience last week with Marina from Transformations. Um, Marina has been a friend for a long time and she wanted to help me with my fear of flying. So um, she came up with a plan and we did it on Thursday and I wanted to tell you all um, a bit about it. So about, I don't know, 12, 13 years ago, I was coming back from a conference down south with my work and um, there was bad weather, so the the plane was delayed by an hour and um, when we eventually did get uh, um, to Edinburgh, we couldn't land because of the bad weather, so we were circling. Whilst we were doing that, the plane um, was obviously flying through a storm, it hit an air pocket and dropped about 2,000 feet. So what that meant is that everything in the plane hit the roof um, and I had a panic attack which I'd never had before, I've never never really had one since, um, certainly not to that degree. I was in that panic attack for at least two days. The next day I didn't show up for work, um, I didn't phone in, well not, not in the morning like you, like you should have done um, because I was still in the panic attack, I was just frozen with fear. and. As far as I was concerned, I nearly died, okay? <laughs> anyway, that has, um, over the years, I've tried to do different things so that I can go abroad on holiday. And I've done, um, I did some hypnotherapy with um, Barry, which got me to Cyprus. And I did um, a fear of flying course with British Airways. Um, that got me to Tenerife or wherever I wanted to go. But I got there looking like a self-harmer because they gave me a few different sort of um, tactics to use while I was on the plane to stop me going into the panic mode and one of them was to wear an elastic band around my wrist so ping that and that distracts the brain from going into the, the panic attack however that meant that I arrived in Tenerife looking like a self-harmer because um, both wrists were black and blue with pinging this elastic band the whole way um, anyway although the hypnosis did get me to Cyprus it didn't have a long-lasting effect um, and that's probably down to me because I went back to my old ways, having my own thought, my, my old thought patterns again. Um, Marina probably meant this to be a two-minute testimonial, but she probably knows that um, it's not going to be. Anyway, so uh, Thursday, what happened was I went to Marina's. I got a train at five o'clock in the morning. I went. She met me at the train station. Well, Barry did. And we had a cup of tea at her house, and then she did her kinetic shift therapy on me. So, um, what is kinetic shift? Marina described it to me as it was um, like NLP on steroids, okay? And the day before, um, I mean, I wasn't nervous because I trust her, but I didn't have a lot of hope that it was going to make a drastic difference to me. But I was wrong. So when I got there, Marina did, she put me into, um, you know, hypnosis and she did her kinetic shift therapy. And we then went to the airport. And usually just going into the airport, I would start to be, to feel anxious and, um, you know, yeah, just to be anxious generally, struggle to, to talk really. So I wasn't like that. I was perfectly calm. So that was a bit strange because the last 10 years I've been anxious in airports, so I wasn't anxious. We stood in the queues, I wasn't anxious. Um, we got on the plane, I wasn't anxious, I just felt calm. I mean, obviously, having avoided going on planes for a long time, it did feel a bit different being on the plane. And I did, I, I did have, you know, a few anxious thoughts. But I was able to do everything else calmly and the little anxieties that I had were probably normal, like what a normal pe person would have. Um, so yeah, it was a beautiful day, there was very little turbulence. We got to London and I still felt fine. Um, we had our lunch, we had to wander around the shops, we got back on the plane and we came home again. Um, so yeah, I mean I realised that um, when I was on the plane, and in the airport that I was behaving like a normal person would, whereas before I was behaving like a lunatic, <laughs> quite frankly. And uh, now I'm able to do these things. I mean, I wouldn't say that I'm going to jump on a plane to America tomorrow, um, but 
I know that I now feel rationally about it all. Whereas before I would avoid even looking at flights, I would avoid even holiday shopping, I wouldn't do any of it because it just gave me the fear. Whereas now, um, I could quite happily, you know, go holiday shopping, I could look at flights, um, I could even go on one and I wouldn't feel anxious. So thank you for that, Marina. Um, although I'm not actually that fussed about going on flights, I felt like I was holding my family back and if they wanted to go on a sunny holiday, um, it was me that was stopping them. But that is not where the kinetic shift therapy ended for me because um, that was, what, three days ago. The day after um, we did the journey, I felt quite tired because it would obviously been draining. We'd been up since five in the morning travelling down to London and back. You know, it was a lot in a day. I felt really tired. But yesterday when I got up, I woke up. Um, I felt quite bright and breezy. I realised the weather was nice. And I thought, oh, I really fancy going for a jog along the beach. Mm, don't usually feel like that in the morning. That's strange. I really do want to do that. And then I thought, you know, I had stuff to get on with, so I went and got on with my stuff. But I said to myself, if you wake up tomorrow and you feel like going for a run on the beach, do it. So I did. I got up this morning, I put on my gym clothes, and I went for a jog. I feel like what Marina's done for me is um, she's given me a spring clean in my head. So any kind of, any sort of negative thoughts that were in my head have been removed. Um, and I can now, I feel a lot clearer in my thinking. I feel a lot more positive. I feel a lot more motivated. I feel like maybe things that were sort of dragging me down before are just not there anymore. Um, and I just feel my energy is better. Um, so overall, I am really, really impressed with Kinetic Shift Therapy. I would highly recommend it to anybody, um, you know, whether you don't have to have a fear of flying, you don't have to have a, a phobia or a fear of anything, this is still going to benefit you. Um, I actually feel like a new person today. Um, I'm aware that I could easily go backwards if I was to let all that negative stuff go back into my head, you know, the anxious thoughts about flying, the negative thoughts about flying, if I, I could easily let them back in, but hopefully I'm not going to, um, and that these results are going to be long lasting, and that I'm just going to feel better and better each day. So thank you so much, Marina at Transformation. If you're interested in making some positive changes, then contact her as well. And I'm sorry for rambling on, but it was always going to be that way. Okay, bye.